What's up? C. Tyson Synopsis. Back again. I just got a new uh, new package today from Bronson MFG. They sent me a package in this right here. We got three different things. We got the beach vest. Salt and pepper beach vest. Came in, looks really nice. 1930s style. Um, the wool is actually really nice. It's not, not itchy really at all. And then there, I like the uh, the logo here. It resembles kind of the the old beach cloth looking logos. 1930s style. And then it looks like it's 58% wool, 42% cotton. And the lining uh, is wool and cotton, so that's it. And the wool and polyester that's it inside. Um, that one came in this this bigger bag right here. And then I always like their little thick kind of trinkets they put in there. The tagging it just always says like a vintage kind of looking vibe to it. So that's the that's the best. They sell this for a hundred bucks, which is crazy. Because you just research and go on eBay and look at the old beach cloth vests. There's some up there for like seven hundred dollars. Um, so that was the first thing I got. Second thing I got is the long sleeve Henley, and this is the they call it apricot is the color, but it's basically just like an off white or like an ecru or whatever. So this one is real nice and thick. Um, I like the, the cuffs are kind of cool, it's definitely got a vintage vibe to it as well, and then I don't know how much the material weighs, but it's pretty substantial, so it's definitely like a heavier weight, definitely really good for the winter. Um, that one came in the smaller bag too, I like these bags too, you can, I always just pull up my shirts and put them right back in there. And that's this guy right here. Um, it's a little bit different than the the short sleeve Henleys they got. This kind of placket is a little bit slimmer. The other short sleeves got a wider placket, which I like. So, uh, but that's that one, and it's got like a little kind of cut on the shoulder. Two little little gusts or something. Um, and this one does have seams on the side. Some of the shirts. The ring spun, so they don't have any seams whatsoever. And then the last thing I got was a pair of 1943 British Army Gurkha pants, is what they call them. I got these because, um, really for work, I thought they were a really cool kind of version of what, you know, khakis or chinos. Got a really cool front pocket. They're kind of wider legs, so if you're into skinny pants, this, this isn't for you. And they got a shorter pocket here that's got a gusset, so you can put some stuff in there. And then they got a little kind of button up closing. And Bronson is a Chinese brand, so if you're going to order, you definitely need to size up one or two sizes um, and just check to see what your sizes are and look at their. They're sizing sharp, so, but they're pretty good at getting back out to you via email. But that's it. That's what I got. The boots I'm wearing are old pair of Chippewas that I uh, got on eBay. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna really enjoy these pieces. Especially the winter time upon us in, in Philadelphia. So, that's uh, anything. Oh, yeah, these pockets are functional as well. Buttons, not, not, uh, or snaps, not, not buttons. Um, yeah, these, uh, the material on these pants as well is really thick as well. Everything from Bronson is really thick and you know, feels like it's made well. I always buy their stuff because it's, it's affordable and it's not as, um, 
expensive as, as a lot of the other kind of vintage brands. But that's it. That's all we got.